Cincinnati's certified most accurate forecast. Well, things are changing as we speak outside tonight. A matter of fact, it's gotten significantly colder. So, yes, it's back to February at least for a day or so before we see things begin to climb as we head into the weekend. The good news is that this bout of cold, at least, is not here to stay too long because we'll start climbing by the weekend. But by early next week, all indications are that we are going to transition back to a colder weather pattern. At least right now, I don't see any significant snow in the forecast, but it looks like after a brief respite, you know, we've had this past week or two. To where temperatures have pretty much been unseasonably mild. We're finally going to see things go back to probably some of that cold we experienced earlier in the month, let's say last month, I should say, back during the month of January. Look at all the blue splattered on the map tonight. Temperatures 20 to almost 30 degrees colder than they were at this very exact same time last night. And boy, that chill is being made worse by the fact that we've got a pretty brisk wind out there. And that wind's not going to let up tonight. And it's going to be a breezy day as we head into your Thursday across the area. So right now we're down to 38, but already below freezing in Indianapolis. And as you head back towards the Mississippi River, temperatures are even lower than that. They are actually now down into the middle and upper 20s out there. So it's a chilly night across the region. Temperatures, again, hovering just shy of 40 at 38 degrees. Gives us a wind chill. Makes it feel like it's closer to below freezing. It feels like it's 30 outside with that northwest wind at 12. Let's have a look at the weather map. Here's what's happening tonight. That storm system from last night, that's pulling away from the area. But in its wake, we've got this mass of cloud cover, low gray cloud cover that's been advancing across the area. This guarantees that tomorrow we will probably be dealing with a cloudy and one of those seasonably cold February Ohio Valley days. Tonight, cloudy skies. At least with the cloud cover tonight, temperatures won't drop off as much as they could, but we'll still sneak our way into the upper 20s to low 30s and most neighborhoods and then highs tomorrow of course with all that cloud cover they won't budge much a matter of fact we'll be lucky tomorrow for many of us to creep our way above freezing probably by a couple of degrees there most areas about 34 35 so here's a look at future cast those clouds are persistent they're not going anywhere in the day tomorrow if anything maybe late tomorrow afternoon there may be a peak or two at the sun but you know what we've done this often enough that optimism really doesn't work i think the clouds are socked in here and then after dark we'll start Start to clear things out. So tomorrow night will be even colder. Some areas will be down into the teens and drop close to 20. And then it looks like a nice looking Friday for the end of the week and a nice look heading into the weekend too as temperatures begin to rebound before they crash early next week. So for tonight, look for a low of about 28 here in the metro area underneath those cloudy skies, breezy and colder. And then for tomorrow, expect mostly cloudy skies, a cold breeze. This icon probably even has too much sun up there for us tomorrow, 35 for an afternoon high. Here's a look at your day planner. 28 at 8 a.m., lunchtime, barely above freezing or right at that freezing mark, and then into the middle 30s late. Here's a look at your seven-day forecast, down to 20 tomorrow night, and then we bounce back into the 40s Friday and Saturday, low 50s on Sunday. And then it looks like we'll go off the cliff again next week with temperatures not climbing above freezing. Did that sound scary? Last, he draws you in. The last five seconds. And then he we'll lays go over it the on the cliff you. next week. <laughs>